special. <laughs> Halloween special. British Columbia, Canada. Vast, rugged, stunningly beautiful. The majority of the population lives in the southern portion of this province. There's ample wilderness to explore, places to hike, camp, take in nature. And sometimes, those taking in that nature vanish without a trace. Some say it's the work of Sasquatch, an entity born of a legend from indigenous people long ago, now part of the mainstream. Over the years, we have traveled to these locations where these people have vanished without a trace. Not necessarily investigating, but taking a look at the area, from the air and on the ground. We have concluded at least in our minds, most of these cases are people that became disoriented, ill-prepared, and met a natural death, nothing too nefarious. There are cases, however, that stand out as genuinely mysterious, things we can't explain by a simple explanation. There have been suggestions the Sasquatch is malevolent does not welcome you with open arms and could dispatch you with extreme prejudice should you encounter them. Others say, no, they're gentle, misunderstood. That seems far-fetched. After all, a creature of that size and intelligence might understand human nature and deem you or I a threat in their domain trespassing in their territory. Far too many people go into the wilderness thinking they know what they're doing and become lost. They wrongly assume search and rescue will find them and bring them safely home. First off, SAR has to know where you went and where you could possibly be. There are animals out there that will do you harm and that may include the Sasquatch. It would be reckless and irresponsible to suggest if you go into the forest, you may encounter a Sasquatch that would harm you or even kill you. For the families agonizing over their missing loved ones, some people take advantage and create imaginary circumstances or events, like the attack of a Sasquatch with no proof. Recently, in Manning Park, a young man went missing for quite a while and he was found deceased no foul play. When you're out in the forest, certainly you have to take care. You're more likely to be attacked by a grizzly or a black or brown bear even than a Sasquatch. Yet behind that mist, there is the mystery. What's out there? What should we be afraid of?
The question remains, what happened to these people? Some vanishing without a trace, disappearing forever, or at least not found, yet. The Sasquatch? Foul play? The most dangerous animal is the human. There's lots of evil people out there, that's for sure. In our time in the forest, our instincts have said, don't go down there, turn around, never ignore your instincts. That's important. If you're going into the forest, make sure you know what you're doing. This has been a special presentation. We would like to thank the following. Land Sea Air Canada for still photography and stock footage. We would like to thank SLH and KLP for their fine camera work. We would like to thank our executive producer TLL for supporting this content. We'd like to thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe to this channel for more. Until next time, thanks for watching. Stay safe, especially if you go out there.